in the name of God. Hello guys, it's our YouTube channel but in binary option is smart. Please subscribe us and find us in social media, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram and Telegram here. So in this session I want to teach you how to work with indicators. In this session I will teach you SMA and EMA how to use it on the bot let me go to the chart and show you what's EMA and SMA as you see here we have moving average indicator moving average when I choose it we will see the MA here and we can customize it here moving average it has a field I always use open you can change it to anything that you want I will show you how to change this in bot and we have period here and I always use 10 you can change it by yourself as you want and the type simple means SMA simple moving average you can change it to exponential moving average means EMA that I show you on bot so I set it on 10 and simple and color is red is good done as you see here we have an indicator here that means moving average as you see here our moving average in this candle is 166.7704 as you see here and in this candle our MA is 166.8036 so each candle has own MA so here we are in volatility 50 index back to bot builder change it to index go to indicator we need SMA simple moving average and we can define it here or we can use in this I prefer you to use this because we need a fresh SMA in each trade so I define it here let's me get it upper as you see here we have input list and period period you know 10 as I showed you here this is period I always use 10 and the input list the input list that I use the open of candle from and I want use this so I can't use this because we need let me show you here for example in input list we need a list of candles a list of candles so I have to change this to the candle list so I can use list here and make a list with it and I can use this element in candle list 
let me finally make a li list of open for example make a list of open of values import list and set sma here let me quiet it and make a list as you see in indicators here and we can make a list on open of candle you can change it to the close and everything you want as you see here open close high low and etc back here and go to indicator and show you what's happened you can use tick lists when you work on ticks and etc that i explain for you next session so we can't use these and we have to make a list of candles with interval open or close and etc i said sma this is a variable i can rename it sma so let me show you with a simple strategy please don't use this strategy in your real account because it's an educational strategy that I use here to show you how to make a bot with indicators and SMA indicators this is my strategy if as you know how to use this if compare last tick or last price as you know from previous session if last tick for example upper than sma which sma this sma that we defined here this sma if last tick upper than sma as you see here This is elastic on the resume so this purchase can't open a trade let's check it if elastic upper resume purchase rise so now we are on the resume let me run and check work it or not as you see here there is no trade here because our price is under SMA let's change it to under SMA purchase rise for example and run so now but open a trade with rise condition because our price is under SMA. I emphasize on it this is an educational strategy please don't use this strategy in your real account because it can blow your account so you can change it more and more and everything you want here for example you can use two part of SMA for example when you make list you can use this indicator with array if you use array you can select what you want in SMA let me show you SMA array and pen I change it to the text
let me check it work it or not here we need variables sma array yes and we need a notification that show us this text let me run it and journal yes this is show us what is our array here we have 1000 of sma in array you can use for example two sma before as you see here let me show you you can use this sma 166.4 here 166.52 if you want work with this sma or smas of these candles you can use sma array and you can use here let me show you for example list let me in list from end here text notification it get from end for example the sma of candle number oh sorry the candle number three show us the sma of candle number three It's zero in SMA array and it's zero. In this text and we can change it to SMA array. Let's check it. Yes, as you see we have this number for candle number three one six six forty point four three six as you see here the candle number three and this is the ma as you see on the screen so you learned how to work with this and if you want in trade use array you can change it and use it here for example if elastic is under the sma array from end the candle number three if it's under it the price under the sma of it let's show you it's under it one two three and price is under this sma and open trade let's back to the indicators and show you the other type is exponential moving average this is same with this and as you see you can here EMA and notification and notification
identify it. Let's. We don't need these. Where it go? Let's use again a notification and variables EMA with for example yellow let's turn off it and run it this is the EMA of candle open of candles and in period 10 let's check it's true or not I change this to from simple to exponential done and it's changed I think change because as we see here we have some difference no this is saying one six six point zero six nine six these are true and these are same as you see we have EMA here and we can use them in purchase conditions as you know I change it to EMA it's simple as you want if elastic under EMA purchase right this is a simple and educational strategy to use this this is our youtube channel binary option smart please subscribe us if you have any question you can ask on comments thank you for watching